Hello dear students, today we are going to work on present continuous tense. Let's start. Today is Sunday. The Wilson family is at home now. Let's see what they are doing at the moment. The boy is watching TV. The cat is sleeping. The girl is listening to music. The dog is eating a sandwich. The parents are reading newspaper. So let's see why we use the present continuous tense. We use it to talk about actions happening now. At the moment of speaking, for example, listen, the birds are singing. Look, the boy is running so fast. These actions are happening now, at the time of speaking, so we use the present continuous tense to talk about them. Also, we use the present continuous tense to talk about temporary actions happening around now but not at the actual moment of speaking. For example, Ted is working late these days. It doesn't mean that it is happening now at the time of speaking. It just means that it is happening around now. They are staying with us this week. Also, this sentence shows us that this is happening around now, but not at the actual moment of speaking. Let's see which time expressions can we use with the present continuous tense. We use now, right now, at the moment, at present, these days, this week, this month. And how can we make positive sentences with the present continuous tense? We use M plus verb ing with I. We use is plus verb ing with he, she and it. And we use are plus verb ing with we, you and they. Let's see the examples. I am cleaning my room now. He is playing in the garden at the moment. She is eating her lunch. The cat is sleeping on the carpet. We are watching the news. You are cooking better these days. The children are singing in the garden. And let's see how we can make negative sentences with the present continuous tense. We use am not plus verb ing with i and we use is not or isn't plus verb ing with he she and it we use are not or aren't plus verb ing with we you and they let's see the examples i'm not cleaning my room now he isn't playing in the garden at the moment. She isn't eating her lunch. The cat isn't sleeping on the carpet. We aren't watching the news. You aren't cooking better these days. The children aren't singing in the garden. And now let's see how we can ask questions with the present continuous tense. We put M to the beginning when we want to ask a question with I and plus verb ing. When we want to ask a question with he, she or it, we put is to the beginning and use verb ing. And when we want to ask a question with we, you and they, we put R to the beginning and use verb ing. Let's see the examples. Is it raining now? 
Yes, it is. Is Mary eating a sandwich at the moment? No, she isn't. Are the children taking care of the flowers at the moment? Yes, they are. Now let's see some examples of questions and short answers. Are you doing your homework now? What is the answer? Yes, I am. Is she helping your mom in the kitchen at the moment? Now we need to give a negative answer. So, no, she isn't. Is Tom talking to his friend on the phone? We are expected to give a positive answer. Yes, he is. Is your dog barking? Again, we will give a positive answer. Yes, it is. Are you and your friends having fun at the party? Yes, we are. Are the children studying maths now? No, they aren't. Please don't forget that studying verbs like like, love, want, now, belong, hate, hear, remember, and etc. do not usually have a continuous form because they describe states rather than actions. Let's see this one. I know where they are. We never say, I am knowing where they are, because now is a study verb. I like playing tennis. It's not, I am liking playing tennis. I want to go to Paris. It's not, I am wanting to go to Paris. I love Italian food. It's not, I am loving Italian food. So, now, use the present continuous form of the verbs. Let's see the first one. Look, the baby blank at you. We need to use the present continuous form of the verb. Remember, we have to use is plus verb ing with the baby. It can be he or she. The baby is smiling at you. Let's see the second one. They blank for the bus. Remember, we use are plus verb ing with they. They are waiting for the bus. The next one. Mom blank a cake at the moment. Now we need to make a negative sentence by using the present continuous tense. Mom means she, so we need to use isn't making. And the next one is a question. Blank, an email to your friend now. Our subject is you, so we need to use R plus verb ing. So are you writing an email to your friend now? Yes, I am. And the next one. The children aren't in the house. They blank in the pool. Remember, we use R plus verb ing with they. So, they are swimming in the pool. The next one is again a question. Blank outside. Now, our subject is the sun. So, it means it. So, we need to use is plus verb ing. So, is the sun shining outside? No, it isn't. Okay, let's see the next one. Again, a question. This time, it's a WH question. What blank now? Our subject is your parents. It's a plural subject. So, we need to say... What are your parents watching now? Another question. Blank. You and your friends visit an aquarium today? Our subject is you and your friends. It means you. Plural you. So we need to say 
Are you and your friends visiting an aquarium today? We are expected to give a negative short answer. So we need to say no, we aren't. Thanks for listening. See you in the next video.